30 litros más de capacidad que tiene una luz en lugar de carga para, cuando vas a cargar, para que cuando llegues por la noche a un punto de carga el, el lugar a ver, a ver, ahora estamos en P oh it's a very important role because this is the only place uh, where we are going to be assembling a light commercial vehicle which is zero emission which is the NV200 which, uh, as you know, will be assembled in our plant in Barcelona. This is a very good sign because it means that all the efforts that are being developed in Spain to reestablish the competitiveness of, of, of Spain are bearing fruit. You know, we are taking note, we are seeing the differences and we are seeing the efforts which are being done and we are very optimistic about the evolution of the competitiveness of, uh, of the Spanish environment. The Spanish government today is offering a good incentive, a very reasonable incentive for consumers to buy electric car. I hope this is going to be sustained in the future. <laughs> I think the main missing point is the development of the charging infrastructure. Consumers need to see uh, places where they can charge their car. The, these charging stations should be visible, they should be available, uh, and, and they should not be something that people worry about. Leaves of lava fur with Norma. depend about when Germany is going to step in. Uh, today when somebody wants to buy an electric car, the first thing he wants to be reassured about why can't he charge the car. Mm -hmm. Obviously he can charge it at home, he can charge it at the office, but if you want to go for a trip, uh, he needs to be reassured on the fact that on the highway or in many places where he may be driving in Spain, there will be enough uh, availability in charging infrastructure. Expect a new generation manufacturing facility is not decided yet, so it's too early for me to tell you. Uh, second, um, 